It's the most rewarding job in the world. Um, and six years later, since I qualified, I'm just so happy that I went into this profession. I feel like it was always a job that I was meant to do and I can't imagine myself doing anything else. I found out very early on in my life that uh, I could be the next uh, Whitney Houston because basically I just couldn't sing very well. So I knocked that one on the head very early on. My main inspiration for becoming a nurse was out of an innate desire to help people, I suppose. I wanted to help people at their time of need. I became a nurse because that's all I ever wanted to do. I was taken as a child by the help that you saw. I loved reading stories about nurses. I loved watching the television programmes. I'd always wanted to be a nurse and look after babies. I hadn't really thought of doing anything else growing up. The reason that I entered nursing was purely down to a television series in the 1970s called Angels. It starred Fiona Fullerton. And what that series did for me was to show nursing as a job that looked pretty much hard work, but also incredibly rewarding and an opportunity to be able to help others that couldn't help themselves. I always knew I wanted to work with children, but I wasn't quite sure what. And then during college, I did um, some volunteering at a school for children with additional needs. And that first sparked my interest in nursing. The reason why I chose to pursue a career in nursing is after helping care for my paternal grandma when I was about 17. Um, I was just in great admiration really of both my parents um, and found it extremely rewarding being able to keep her comfortable and just really being there during the last few stages of life. There's a lot of nurses in my family, my mum, my auntie um, and my grandma, they were all nurses and I think especially talking to my mum who's now a health visitor, I really enjoyed listening to um, all of her stories about her job and I did a little bit of volunteering in some um, nurseries for children with additional needs when I was 18 and then from that just loved it. And my mum inspired me really because she was very dedicated and she did her training when, you know, when you got married, you couldn't always continue to be a nurse. I always wanted to be a nurse and work with children. I've worked on a new nurse unit since qualifying. I was inspired by my family, and particularly my mum, who was a nurse in auxiliary many years ago. And, uh, and lots of my family members have become nurses and other sort of careers that's work, uh, working in the NHS. And also my generations, um, particularly the Windrush era as well, can't forget uh, those as well, who sort of certainly inspired me. There were a lot of opportunities within nursing, it was quite a diverse career. And because I'm quite driven, I saw that that was a career that I wanted to pursue. And then I went straight from college to university, um, so I didn't have much experience. But from my first placement in Sheffield Children's Hospital, I realised that's what I wanted to do. And it was the right job for me. To be a nurse, was was everything and you really needed it really needed to come from the heart which I think it has. Six years later it's the best decision that I've ever made and um, I think I've got the best job in the world. In 2006 my brother was in an almost fatal accident on the M6 and was taken to Wallsgrave Hospital or well, that was the site where Angels was filmed. I spent that very first night in hospital with him. It was incredibly worrying. But we look back on that now and smile that I got to do my night shift on the Angel site.